perfect. Alright guys, pretty big day today. Got lots of parts that I'm gonna put on. Um, this video is going to be broken up, so forgive me if you see some uh, different stages of the car, but uh, in this video we're going to be putting on the TRD duck spoiler on my 2022 Subaru BRZ. So you can see right here, get a close-up shot of what it looks like before. And that's after. Looks so much more aggressive. And well, truthfully, I haven't put it on yet. It's still loose. Um, before I do put it on though, it's a very simple and easy install. Um, I need to clean my car because it is filthy. And uh, before I do that and take the tape off of the back side of this I want to let you guys know that when you do get the spoiler it's I'm uh, going to have some bolts here OEM factory bolts um, import image racing which by the way I got this from them paint matched to uh, the Subaru crystal white pearl perfect you know it's the same color as a uh, halo white from Toyota um, so I got this from them I saw their video um, you do not have to drill into the trunk to install this. Um, it's kind of redundant because some of the bolts are held on with tape. So, you know, the, the say goodbye to that extra security. It's pretty much the same thing apart from these two. Regardless, we're going to wipe down the car, take the tape off, and uh, we'll go from there. So let's get this car clean. All right, guys. So forgive me for being kind of ghetto. Um, got a Windex bottle with soapy water and uh, wax and dry spray wax. I might not use this because I don't know if it's going to affect the um, uh, 3M tape sticking to the car, but uh, let's just do the soapy water first and I'll let you know how it turns out. So I skipped on the spray wax I think we're just gonna stick it on there because it's looking pretty clean and shiny. You know, I overestimated how dirty the car was. It was just a little bit of dirt and rain dust. And uh, you can see right there, fucking flies, man. You can see right there how dirty the car is. And uh, clean, thanks to soapy water. Um, so one more little pass over before I put the thing on, but uh, I will show you how I line it up. Okay, so using the import image racing method, I'm just going to line it up on the trunk. It's looking good from both sides. Decent space there and there. We're at the edge over here. And just let me give you a little detailed look so you can see what we're dealing with. So, leaving a little bit of a gap there and a little bit of a gap there. I'm trying to keep it as close to the edge as possible. I'm gonna push it a little bit back, a little bit back. Uh, there's a slight lip right here in the front, and you can see these tabs. That's where we're gonna pull our tape from and stuff. That's where we're at. That right there is looking pretty solid to me. That's about where I want to have the wing at. Um, you know, it's an OEM part, so it's really hard, I think, to mess this up. Right, looks good. So I did my guide marks on the top and did it on the side just in case, you know, I get a little confused or I get a little too excited. And the uh, last step, I guess, is going to be to get an X-Acto knife, or I have this little set that comes with different kinds of knives. And uh, we're just gonna make some slits here. 
and uh, you know, so we can move the spoiler around freely, take off the tape, and then stick it back on. So that was enough of that. I was having way too much fun lining that thing up. Um, I'm sure you can see in the little clips that I'm gonna post how I kind of struggled here towards the front. Um, the 3M tape is looks like it's really sturdy and it's super strong. It stuck immediately as soon as I let this down. You know, I don't even want to try prying it because it's still fresh and brand new, but I don't think even if I tried, I could get this off cleanly. Like, I can't, I have to reiterate how strong the, uh, the factory 3M tape is. Um, so yeah, just be careful. Uh, make sure to pull off the tape on the underside of the 3M, the protective uh, covering, you know, the plastic. Make sure to take that off carefully um, and maybe get a second person to help you because I started panicking on this side. I peeled the little tab that was up here, but I, I, it broke off, you know, so I had to dig under from here and get this side and peel it all the way out. So yeah, just keep that in mind. Um, again, super easy install on the spoiler um and that was it you know didn't take more than 10 minutes um and that was because i was filming this video i probably could have done it way quicker let me know what you guys think i think it's a really good addition to the subaru brz and the uh, toyota 86 um like comment subscribe um hit me up social media john sauce peace out